I want to win. I want that trophy. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be doing a video with my nephew. Hi. We're doing Clash of Champions predictions, so we're going to say who we think is going to win the matches, and yeah. So the first match that's on the card is the pre-show match, and that is the Raw Women's Championship, Asuka versus Zelina Vega. Who do you think is going to win? Asuka. I mean, it's kind of obvious that Asuka's going to win too, but I also have like this other like idea that I'll talk about later in the show. What? <laughs> None. Um, but yeah, so my pick is Asuka. Okay, the next match, I'm not sure what the next match is going to be, but I'm pretty sure to kick off the whole thing, since they want it to look good, it'll probably be the ladder match between Jeff Hardy, AJ Styles, and Sami Zayn. Uh, my pick to win that match is going to be Sami Zayn. I want... I want Hardy to win, but I feel like Sami Zayn's gonna just steal it. I think he's gonna win because he just brought him back, so why would they bring him back just to have him lose his like first big match? Yeah, so I'm gonna go with Sami Zayn. Okay, next we have the SmackDown Tag Team Titles, and it's Shinsuke Nakamura. Oh my god, I can't talk. Nakamura. And Cesaro versus the Lucha House Party. Oh god, I'm gonna go with the first team. Cesaro and Nakamura. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go with them too because I think they're breaking up the Lucha House Party because they keep making Kalisto and Lince Dorado fight. And uh, the only one that I like out of that team anyways is Lince Dorado, so I'm good with them breaking up. Okay, the next match is probably going to be the women's tag team match. Uh, Shania Payne versus the Riot Squad. Um, who do you think is going to win? The Riot Squad. Uh, that is who I think is going to win too because Shayna and Naya are not even a real team, so goodbye. Yeah. Uh, the next match is probably going to be um, Apollo Crews versus Bobby Lashley for the US title. Uh, I think that Bobby Lashley is going to keep his title. It's, a, it's Crews and Lashley, right? Yeah. I'm gonna go with Cruz. Is there a reason why? There's gonna be a bunch of cheating, and then um, Ricochet is gonna get the final part of it, and then he's gonna pin. Um, the next match is probably going to be Bailey versus Nikki Cross. Uh, who <laughs> do you think is going to win? If Sasha's not out there, it'd be um, God Nikki Cross, but. If she is, Bailey. Well, Bailey and Sasha broke up. I don't know if you... Oh, it's been a while since I've watched it. So I'm going to go Cross. I think Nikki Cross is going to win too because Helena Cell is coming up and what they keep doing with her and Alexa, I think Alexa is going to go full like Bray Wyatt mode and then turn on Nikki. Then it's going to like have some like weird thing happening at Helena Cell. So that's my opinion. Um, but I can also see it going the opposite way of Alexa coming out to help Nikki but costing her the match. And then Bailey retains it. Or lie. Sasha might just get involved. Or both of them might get involved and then the match will be, be a ruined. DQ and Bailey wins. Yeah. Then next we'll probably get the Raw Tag Team Champion match. Uh, who do you think is going to win? Who's in again? It's Angel Garza and Andrade taking on the Street Profits. <laughs> the Street Profits will win. That's who my main pick is too, but I also feel like WWE might swerve us, and then they might give Andrade and well, they keep fighting. Angel the titles, and then Zelina Vega might win the Raw Women's Championship, and then that will be like a whole plot of them all turning on each other to make it seem like they hate each other, and then they win end up winning all the titles because people think that they hate each other. So well, they did fight backstage. People can fake it. Bailey and Sasha had a fight like two years ago and then it took them forever for them to actually turn on each other. Oh yeah, true. But my main pick is going to be uh, the Street Profits because they keep teasing Angel versus Andrade, so yeah. The next match will probably be Randy Orton versus Drew McIntyre for like the hundredth time. McIntyre. For like the hundredth <laughs> time anyways, uh, I think Drew McIntyre is going to retain again. How many times have they fought? Like two or three. I'm going to go with Orton. 
Because McIntyre's won both of those, right? Yes. Yeah, I'm going to go with Orton. And then the last match, the match that I care the least about, is Roman versus Jey Uso. <laughs> this match is a joke, but I'm going to go with Roman. Uh, that's what I'm going with too, and yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, do all that. Um, are you excited for the pay-per-view? I might not even get to watch it, so I don't know. But hopefully. But, are you yeah. excited for me to tell you who wins? No. I hope I get to watch it though. The match I'm most excited for is the Oscar match that is not even on the pay-per-view. I just want to see the... The match I'm really looking forward to see is the Nikki Cross and Bailey match because if Alexa turns on Nikki again... My other thing is, my other prediction that has nothing to do with this pay-per-view that is like later, the Survivor Series, I'm hoping it like has this new like version of it since they're giving all these pay-per-views new names like Gold Rush and all that. I hope that NXT and NXT UK are involved in Survivor Series so that way all the matches can be like Fatal 4-Way matches. Uh, like cool. we could see Kaylee Ray versus Nikki Cross versus Candice LeRae versus Oscar. Like, that would be a cool match. And Bailey. I said Nikki Cross instead of Bailey because oh, Nikki uh, Cross might win. Of course, I got confused. And then we'd see Drew McIntyre versus Roman Reigns versus Finn Balor versus I don't know who the UK champion is. I'm I, pretty sure That it's... would be a good match to see. I would, uh, I would love that match. And then, like, then we'd have five versus five versus five versus five elimination tag team match, which probably would be like an hour and a half long, but who cares because those are my favorite type of matches. Yes, the ones I really like. That's why I like my favorite pay per view. Besides the Royal Rumble. So, your favorite is the Royal Rumble? Um, well, no, I like Survivor Series the most because it has the five on fives. Okay, you copy me. Anyways, um, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Wondering, would you be.